Hello everybody and welcome back to Final Fantasy XII. Yes, I'm still playing this and Outer Worlds. It's just life and my own ineptitude make it so that I don't play as regularly as I'd like. <laughs> um, but, uh, this will date this video. I just finished watching the 12th. I watched some of the 2020 Game Awards and uh, there's some really great things that happened and also some not so great things that happened, but it's okay. <laughs> Anyway, the most exciting thing about uh, Final Fantasy right now and my current YouTube stuff is that um, I got a new streaming laptop. It's a really powerful one, so hopefully we won't have uh, any more problems with the game freaking out or recordings freaking out. The only thing I have to worry about is that I had to set it up for an entirely, like, well, you know, an entirely new system and it's been a while, so hopefully things are working the way I want them to over there. Um, my eyes are so dry. I freaking winter's the worst. Um, so let me know if you see any problems. If I see any problems, I'll try to fix it. But there, this one may be a bit wonky. I do have a new tower coming. I spent so much money this Black Friday. I have a new tower coming in as well soon. So then I'll be able to play these games. Like right now, this one's playing at 720 because the tower, like my desktop tower, isn't great yet. Um, but. Um, what's the word I was thinking? Um, but my streaming laptop is good, so that and that's where things are recorded from. But it'll be really nice to have a tower to be able to handle these, like, well, this isn't like a super high-powered game, but <laughs> it, at least it would hopefully be able to handle playing it at a better rate. But anyway, I'm just talking now. Uh, it's been a long day, but I feel awake enough to hopefully play this game. Our goal right now is to, I know is to, we're leveling up right now. We're almost done leveling up. I just need to get, we're going to the Tomb of Wraithwall, and this is where we are in the Sand Sea. Mate. That's right, I could keep, I could just go right now. All right, I think what I wanted to do was go back here and explore around, but I went over there and I died. I vaguely remember. I remember dying. <laughs> um, but I need both the year and Fran leveled up a little bit more, and then I'll at least be close enough to where I need to be, to where to where the levels that I think are recommended for the area, which I think is 15, 16, and we'll have everybody being at 14 plus Penelope at 16 because she's with me all the time. Oh, uh, yeah, okay. I know I, I, I have fairly recently edited the video, the last two couple of videos for this. But, okay. Attack. Are you gonna, are you gonna do it? it? Takes him freaking forever. Wow, he just got this, like, free. Oh no. It's okay though, we bought stuff. I remember, I remember this now too. We bought stuff. Wait. Oh, okay. I was like, what? They were the enemy is aiming for. Wow. Okay, just to sleep, everybody. <laughs> Holy cow! He just like, cheese Louise. Okay, let's um. Nope. Uh. Nope. 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 Balta, you're a fine leader. What am I trying to do? F. Items. Where are Echo? Nope. A handkerchief. Hurts his kiss. Use it on Bosch. Wakey, wakey, beautiful. Um, and then we. Come on. Oh, F. So I really did enjoy um, doing sort of the D&D &D stuff from before, but I forgot to grab any of that before this, so that's exciting. 
Which you guys get to listen to me. Okay, so I guess I could talk a little bit about the Game Awards. Um, I only watched uh, a little bit because I was only invested for the Dragon Age announcement. But, spoilers, I guess, uh, there was an unexpected, secretive, sneaky Mass Effect announcement, too, which I'm actually a little upset about, but... <laughs> um... It's just that it seemed like, from, apparently there was some stuff calling out, um, or... I recognize I stuff things. in it from- What? Holy- What? I mean, Pinello, yeah, she had silence on, but holy cow. Um... Come on, let me just- How do you want me to do this, then? Okay, oh, I gotta- Okay. Lossler, jeez. I know she's got silence on her, but right now we'll, uh, we'll figure it out later. Actually, oh yeah. I think this guy is... Bo yeah, Vossler has the Phoenix down automatic. And let's do... Anyway, the the stuff that I that I recognized in the Mass Effect trailer, it was all very you know vague and beautiful, and basically is an announcement for pre-development. Um, but it seemed like too much of it was harkening back to old stuff, like the old trilogy, and that's one of the things I really hope they don't do is get all like freaked out from all the angry fanboys who were pissy about Andromeda not being exactly what they wanted. Um, and Andromeda wasn't an exact, wasn't, wasn't what I thought it was going to be and wasn't necessarily what I wanted, but I still enjoyed it as a game. And I felt like it was, at the very least, a very brave, you know, leap forward into something new within an existing franchise, rather than just, like, literally reviving Shepard again, you know, you know what I mean? And, like, <laughs> just... Beating a literal dead, like bringing a like beating a dead horse to death, like beating a horse to death, and then bring. How are you dying so fast? And then um. <laughs> wait, 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 wait. We need to bring him back because he's not getting XP if he's if he dies. Come back. Oh, and your freaking Bash is asleep. I don't. Um, I should pay attention, but. Oh, stop! Oh my gosh, you're hitting Vanello. Hey, Botha here, you just need to attack. Oh, wait, wait, wait. What am I doing? I don't think I have a... Like, something to, like, draw their attention to me. Okay, both the ears, stop. Okay. Is he is he gonna No, he's just stealing from everybody. It's because they don't have any damage, but Anyway, I just don't want them to, like, be like, Oh, everybody got all, like, whiny about Andromeda, and so now we're gonna just, you know... We're gonna go back to where it's safe, and, like, literally revive Shepard for a second time. Somehow, in some way. Just... And they had Liara in the trailer and everything. I was just... I don't want to rehash it. The trilogy was great, I but I don't want to go back. I want to do something new. It's like Star Wars. Like I don't care about Han, Luke, and Leia. Like I don't care about their stories. Like I've seen it. I want to see new things, and that's what Andromeda was, despite it also having like you know problems and things that I didn't necessarily like either. 
But I could, you know, it's way, way, they said they're just in early development, so it's way too early for me to be like, you know, oh no. And apparently they did have some Andromeda stuff in there, but the only stuff I really recognized that was visibly, like, Mass Effect stuff was stuff from the Milky Way galaxy and not Andromeda, and so I was just like, mm, please don't do that. It was, oh wow, that was way more health than, well, no. Okay, no, that was pretty good. How much, like, pretty accurate to how much health she had. I guess I will give... Uh, you just need, like, a potion? Okay. I'm just, I'm just beg- I'm begging Bioware, please don't... Don't go back in time, you know? Give us new stories, new people, new new people to fall in love with. If you go back to Andromeda. We have so many unfinished stories there. Maybe I give. Oh wait, actually, let's have Pinello. I I could. I'm sure I could get like way more. You know, eloquent if I wasn't trying to do this at the same time. But that's, that's what I can do. The Dragon Age stuff, however, <laughs> was so hype. I was like, oh, so, wait, did I just? Oops, I did not mean to give that to him, but it's fine. What am I trying to do here? The Dragon Age stuff is, again, it's like one of those, um, Kind of early trailers, but we did, and, and it did specifically say not in game, you know, not 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 gameplay or whatever, you know, on the trailer. But it let's uh, all right. I was like, let's save, but we can't do that. It just looked really cool, and I'm really excited. Like, are you good? Oh, I don't know. You don't want spoilers for it. There's nothing that, like, really does. Oh, my gosh. Uh, hang on. Let me see if I can just, like, damage everybody. Because we need, we need all the year to stop trying to steal from everybody. Which, he, this, this is how he's dying. <laughs> he's just running around trying to steal from everybody. And I did more than damage. I, I still don't really know how Traveler works, but uh, it's fine. Oh, um... Bash! Vanilla, I don't think I had anything that fixed slow yet. Stop trying to steep. No, stop, stop. <laughs> <laughs> it's fine. You can try to steal from that guy and then we'll try to damage him. There we go. Now he's attacking. Oh my goodness. Anyway, it's the, the Dragon Age trailer is voiced by Varric. Which is like, oh, so exciting! And just a few of the things he says are just... I don't know, like, I can't... Well, there was a couple things that he said where it's just, oh, where he's like... It, so it seems like we're gonna get, like, a, a, a normal, like, a, like, a normal person as the, as the protagonist. So it's gonna perhaps harken back to Dragon Age 2, which is a fantastic, you know... Oh, no. Is it, which is a fantastic game that I freaking love. Um... Where, like, you're just a normal person trying to do your best, you know? Oh, yeah! Was that, was that Balthayer? Balthayer level up? You're just a normal person trying to get by in a world that wants you dead, you know? Um, or, you know, maybe a world that doesn't care or whatever, you know? It's not like, it's not like the Warden where, like, you become this, like, mega important person or in the Inquisitor where you become a mega important person. Like, Hawk was just somebody who was like, who became important in their city, but never in this, they never really had like the same, um, sway on like global politics. What, what I really liked about Dragon Age, or one of the things I really liked about Dragon Age 2 was that 
You you literally just had to like deal with the consequences of people like the warden and the inquisitor, for example, like making large decisions. Like people like that with that amount of power making decisions that affected your life as a person, as a normal person, you know. And and you just had to like deal with it as best you could and navigate the world as best you could and like like again you had power in your own sphere but it wasn't it wasn't like a global thing which i i actually really enjoyed that take like I, I've, I've always been curious like you know like in a lot of ways like oh i wonder what it would be like for just a normal person having to see all this and you can make the argument that your warden or your inquisitor was a normal person you know until they got like all this responsibility thrust upon them and that hawk is an exceptional individual in a lot of ways but like I don't know. I I really liked uh, Dragon Age 2 a lot for what it for what it attempted for what it did successfully, um, which was have like a very tragic hero or heroine, um, but also one that like could laugh and cry and like I don't. There, I feel like that game out of all of them has the most heart in a lot of ways. Uh, anyway, this is not my treatise on Dragon Age 2, even though I love it. Um, but... It's a really good game, I highly recommend it if you haven't played it. Have these guys, like, not taken damage at all? They are so sturdy, oh my gosh. Jeez. But yeah, I, I'm excited, and what I what I was hoping for in in, in Dragon Age Four is that you were a, a normal person kind of again. And it says like, well, I don't want to spoil. I guess I don't want to spoil Inquisition on the off chance no one's like really seen it or anything. But the Dragon Age games always you, you play as a different protagonist each time, you know. And while I do want to see my Inquisitor at least once in the next game. Like, I legitimately do. I don't... I, I, I want her to be able to show up. Like, I want to be able to see her. Because there's a little bit of unfinished business left for her. Uh, but... I'm excited. I'm super excited to play a new protagonist. It looks like we'll be in Tevinter. It looks like we'll be playing somebody from Tevinter, potentially. At least in the trailer. I don't know. I'm just guessing that the person that's like this shadowy cloak figure is the person that we're going to play as. And I don't know. Anyway, I was just super excited. Super duper excited. It looks really, really good. And they showed Solas at the end, and I was so excited! I know, he's a very controversial figure, but I love him. I want to also punch him in the face, but... But I, but I love him dearly. What is that thing doing? <laughs> it's doing like an amazing little backflip. Oh, I'm just so excited. I'm so excited. And it's crazy to me. Like, I only watched a little bit of the Game Awards, and I'm like, there's so many games being made. Like, how does anybody play all of these? Like, I think it's impossible. But, like, you, you would have to, like, oh, nah. Oh, good. <laughs> like, I don't know. I guess, I mean, there's a game for everybody out there, you know? Like, and there's just, there's just so many. Luckily, from what I saw, a lot of them were like ones I wasn't really interested in, but some of the indie games looked really fun. A lot of them, they were, it seems like they're trying to bring back zombies again, and I'm like, didn't we, I thought we were all decided that we were done with that. Like, are we done with that? Yes, please? But, but apparently not. <laughs> Uh, and there's like, I think some more survival games, like, like, uh, you know, you know, survival games. But, I wasn't paying that much attention. Every time, though, it was so funny in the Discord with my, with everybody, you know, everybody, uh, like my friends and everyone that, we, that we've met off, like, YouTube and Twitch and stuff like that. Um, I was like, they, they, we were all in the same boat. Every time we saw, like, a castle in the distance or something, uh, we were like, oh my gosh, there's a Dragon Age! And then there was one, there is one game coming out, I think in 2021, that, like, had dragons, and I was like, oh my gosh, it's Dragon Age! And then I noticed that, like, what? Well, like, within, within, like, a second of me noticing, 
you know, that it had dragons. I was like, wait a second. I was like, that person is about to hop on that dragon's back. <laughs> like, uh, there's, where am I trying to go? I was like, there's no way in Dragon Age they let us ride the dragons. You know, I was like, that would be awesome if they did. Hang on, I'm actually gonna, these guys were kind of mean. Take a potion. That did not do much. Let's see. Here. Actually, yeah, go ahead and heal yourself. And then. I don't know. I keep wanting to go to items for health potion. I really need to get someone like Vossler with 200 weapons. I really, I really like that. Oh, dang! I'll be using level 15 now. Wait! Oh, jeez. My bad. They all came over to me. I've got everybody doing the same, trying to do the same target. Let's go ahead and again. I can do it again. Bah. I feel like there was like a big guy here that's not here anymore. Like, I was just minding my own business. Pinello is just gonna rank up so fast. Any treasure chest? Sephiroth's gonna be in Smash, so uh, that was exciting for the Smash people. It's an odd little organism, the Smash people, but, you know, live and let live. <laughs> no, I'm sure it's great. It's just never the first scene I was into. I like uh, esports, though, a lot. I like, specifically, I like, I like watching Overwatch League. I don't like any of the others, really. I guess I can. I guess I can't be like, oh yes, I've tried them all and don't like them. I just have zero. I play Overwatch a ton. I still play Overwatch. Oh crap. So weak to lightning. Well, I think I've got. Oh, were they not aggressive? Maybe. I feel like they were, they were gonna get aggressive. They're kinda cute, honestly. They are just guarding the treasure chest and I was like, ah! Question mark? I hope there's a save crystal in there. I guess it saves on the transition. Ooh, an oasis. Oh, never mind. It's just the sand sea. <laughs> we are near that. Let's see. And now I... Oh my gosh, there's so much. We must be about halfway across the sand sea. We're only halfway across the sand I certainly hope, I certainly hope that this area isn't like a higher level than what we currently are. Like, it's like, oh, I'm like, oh, I gotta get to 15, 16, then we'll be good. And they're like, no, that was actually just the area you were in. <laughs> I 
Wait, when did Fran become in charge? I thought, I, I thought it was Vossler. I don't really care. Well, I don't have her set to steal. I don't think she has steal. It's okay, that's why she's been alive this whole time. Oh. Uh, oh, were you in, were you talking to that person? I'm sorry, I've been murdering them as I come across the sea. I wonder if it's like, uh, the man, one of the more recent Mandalorian episodes. Oopsie daisy. You're super cute. They're usually a violent lot, but this one wanted to help. Oh. T tell me. The Urta Nyensa are all up in a panic about a creature on the Nam Yensa Sansi, their blood enemy, it seems. One of them is asking for help, and Urutan Yensa asking for help. Whatever it is, it's got to be bad. Koopa! You look pretty strong. Maybe you could have a swing at the thing. Koopa! It's supposed to be something like a giant tortoise. I think I've seen a picture. He said he'd found some treasure of the Sand Sea, too. Why, you might be able to claim that as a reward if you're sex su successful. I can't talk. Wow, I just noticed Fran's running animation. Wow. That's actually amazing that she still can move. Look at that. Oh my gosh, could you, oh my gosh, look at her tip. That's actually so painful to look at. I'm, ow, 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 ow. Unless like her structure is different in her legs, like that would be so painful. Oh my gosh. I did like 200 calf raises once because I was determined to, to hurt myself, I guess. <laughs> oh, I was, uh, I was like, I was working out with my dad, dang it. I shouldn't be Fran because she's a long range person. Um. Oh. There, we should let Vasa run in. Oh, okay. Um. I don't know what I was saying. I'm like, I'm wide awake, and then I'm yawning like six times. Eee, 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 wait, 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 wait. Oh man, now I'm gonna be the first one to attack it anyway. She just kicked me in the knees. Well, maybe the shin, because of her ridiculous legs. Anyway, her ridiculous legs. Like, oh yeah, it was the calf raises that I did. <laughs> I did like 200 calf raises one night when I was doing like training for soccer uh, in high school. And it was, uh, the next day I woke up and actually could not walk. I could not walk. I could not, I could not put my legs on the ground and support my own weight. It was one of the most painful things I've ever experienced. And the cap raise is just where you stand flat on your feet and then you stand up on your tippy toes and then you slowly lower it down again and then you go again over and over and over again. And I was determined to be like the beefiest, strongest person on the team. And I ended up not being able to walk for like three days. And my dad's a physical therapist so uh, he was, you know, Oh, that's actually... If I'm... Oh, dang. Eh, eh, eh. Um... There we go. Why do you have to get that close with a bow and arrow? Oh, I sure wish... I could give... A nice staff to Canelo, but alas, I haven't found any yet. I actually have um. Kind of want to like zoom out. I don't, but I don't want to like be looking straight at the ground. Usually when I'm playing one of the 
melee guys, like, they'll attack even if I don't tell them to, you know, like, they'll, they'll just keep meleeing on the target or whatever. But I think, unless I'm just not giving Fran enough time. Yeah. Let's actually, darling, heal Bosh. Libra. I think I still, let me make sh Wait. Uh, yeah, Fran whoop, is nearly. Oh, yeah. <laughs> she just needs to kill one more thing. Everybody. Huh. Dang it, I had my bow ready before he had his sword. Oh, what? Why are you like glowing? Wait, hang on. Let's use. Oh, I have thunder. Nice. Very nice. It didn't do a lot of damage, but. Oh, there she goes. Okay. Ooh, oh, Vossler. Vossler is like really great. He's doing great. Um, cure Bosh. Oh, he doesn't really need it. But let's also. Nope. Vossler. Fran, feel free. Alright! Dope! This is so dope. Okay. Bosh is level 15. Canelo is 17. We're doing so great. Okay. Let's do licenses. Oh, dang. Actually, we should. I guess we should probably end it here. We should probably end it here. Did I freaking. I freaking need to give. I need to take that trinket off of Ash and give it to somebody else. She's got so many points, I have no idea what to do with them. Hang on, really quick. I am gonna, I'm gonna, I am gonna take that off of her. Remove the golden amulet. You need accessory six, though. I don't know if anybody else has accessory six. Let's see. No. I mean, I guess I could give it to Pinello. I don't know what accessories level she has. Oh, uh, yeah. I have enough for that. Accessories five. Accessories six. Right. Yes, okay, good. Then let's give that to her. She's got a lot of really useful abilities. Equip the golden amulet. All right, well, thank you all so much for joining me and just listening to me ramble about things I'm excited about and things I'm nervous about for the future of Bioware while I'm playing a Final Fantasy game. And I only brought up Sephiroth, like, once, briefly. But Sephiroth isn't my thing. He's hot, but he's, uh, I like the dark-haired guy better. Uh, I don't remember his name, but I remember seeing him in pictures and thinking he was real hot. Anyway, um, thank you all so much for joining me. I appreciate it. I hope you've been doing well. And I hope this video works. I'll see you next time. <laughs>